Well, in another night of directionless trade overseas, Australian shares have started negatively for a fourth straight day. Wall Street had a mixed night and was positive at some stages before the Dow Jones closed 54 points lower. The session was overshadowed by a negative quarterly GDP report, which downgraded US growth estimates for the third quarter. And it looks like the ASX 200 will be trading negative territory today, and it's currently down around 22 points. Making news today, property developer Stockland has affirmed its full year guidance despite soft sales in the first two months of the financial year. The company, up 1.6% today at $3.15, said residential soft sales conditions in July and August would mean profits would be skewed to the second half of the year. Elsewhere in the market, programmed maintenance services has returned to first half profitability in all of its divisions. The company today reported profits of $11.6 million for the six months up to 30 September, a turnaround from its $3 million loss in the prior period. The maintenance and project services company is up a quarter of a percent today at $2. And finally, on the currency front, the Aussie dollar is again struggling against the greenback as investors keep up their risk aversion. It's now buying 98.4 US cents. This is John Bowers for Baker Young Stockbrokers.